Hi, my name is Kyla Imani. I'm a singer-songwriter, and my song, No Humanity, is on the Driving While Black soundtrack. Then it's violence, too much silence in the air, are people scared? Feels like nobody cares. For the Driving Wall Black soundtrack, I wanted socially conscious young voices, new voices that were part of an emerging movement. When we go outside the house, build this country on our backs, they just keep breaking us down. It's 2020, what the hell is that about? I'm trying to figure out. And uh, to get in touch with that, I consulted Ani Roseboro. Kylie Mani, her father, Blondell McMillan, is an old friend of mine. And his daughter, when she released No Humanity, I thought, wow, what an amazing song. And once again, it's speaking to the moment. It's speaking to what's happening right now in this country. When Ani brought me a video of Kyla Amani, I was instantly sold. She has a star-like quality, she's very talented, and she was absolutely serious about the commitment to social responsibility. I was inspired to write No Humanity after seeing the video of Ahmaud Arbery being shot and killed. It really hit a nerve and I knew I couldn't stay silent. I have to use my gift to speak up on this, so people want to hear my message and that my music can be a part of this wave of social change for social justice. The point of the song is so much bigger than me, so I'm just happy that people are sharing it and want to hear my message. You do everything to blend. We shouldn't have to worry when we Kylo's 18 years old and really on the forefront of the TikTok generation. Um, and her message is really powerful and really strong and comes from a place of fairness and uh, innocence and what, what we expect in America. We protest the streets and you want to know why because people dying, mama's crying. It's no longer underlying and they keep on justifying. So we gotta keep on trying. Rest in peace to all the angels. I'm giving a portion of the proceeds that I earned from No Humanity to a foundation called Until Freedom. Until Freedom is an amazing social justice organization focused on reforming the justice system, and I will also be giving away a portion of the proceeds to the family of Ahmad Arbery for the song was originally dedicated to him. Justice. No justice, no peace, no humanity. How could you want this? How could you want this? Every bit of the song is so powerful and, and uh, kudos to her. Uh, I'm blessed to be a part of this because this is what I've been talking about for a long time, uh, a, a, a merging of uh, generations. I think that's so important. They certainly have a different charge. I mean, they're just putting it out there and rightfully so. Working on this project was, uh, as I said, a breath of fresh air, and I wish the best for her. I, I think she's going to have a wonderful career, and especially being a part of this. For my song to be on the Driving While Black soundtrack, I'm just so thankful that my music can be a part of a project that educates people and hits so close to home. You know, my culture and my people mean everything to me, so I'm just happy to be a part of such change, and for my music to be a part of that, it, it blows my mind. Rest in peace to all the angels that we love.